Number seven, it has us have some matrices and wants us to add them. And again, I do not know why this isn't just a perfect, it's some problem when I download the PDF into this Active Inspire, there's a little glitch that messes it up. Anyway, we wanna add these guys, adding piece of cake, no challenge. Top left with top left, eight, just like you would think it was. Negative five and four is negative one. Three and six, nine, negative one and five, four, kaboom, done. If I asked you to add them, it's a piece of cake. Okay, That shouldn't be a challenge at all. What if I multiply by a number on the outside? You just distribute it through, that's all you do. So I'm gonna have what, 20 and 20, five times eight, 40. As long as I can multiply by five, I will have the correct answer. 10 and five times six is 30. Okay, those are super simple. Here comes the challenge, multiplying them. Multiplying them is always a challenge and the commutative property doesn't hold. So E times F is different than F times Z. You'll get completely different answers. Okay, now how do I multiply it? Well, just like RC colon, just like we named these, I'm gonna do first row times the first column. Now I'm gonna do first row times the next column and first row continue until I'm done. And then I'll go second row times first column, second row. That's how we're gonna do it. So what does this give us? Well, let's see, here's what it gives us. I do three times six plus the negative five times the one. Now I'm gonna continue first row times the next column. So I'm gonna have three times the four plus negative five times the one. Now I would continue first row times the next column, but there are no more columns. So I drop down to the next row and start all over. So I do three times the six plus negative one times the one. And then I continue it times the next column, three times four plus negative one times one. Now all I got to do is clean it up. I'm going to have a two by two answer here. So I have 18 minus five. I have what? 12 minus five. I have 18 minus one and I have 12 minus one. Okay. Sort of notice a little pattern there, but don't worry about that. 18 minus five is 13. 12 minus five is seven. 18 minus one here is 17. 12 minus one is 11. And there we have our answer to multiplying these two matrices.